Hey guys, uh, this is Samuel here, and uh, I, I actually have something that you're really gonna like, and uh, I ordered off of eBay, and uh, I decided to do this before my um, vacation camping trip uh, that's actually gonna be uh, this week after next week and whatnot. Because, you know, first of all, I really got to tell you that I'm actually on a uh, a two-week trial of going to TCRC for a while. Because my mother thought TCRC would be the best thing for me and stuff. That's what TCRC really is. It's a little bit like Epic, but it's way cooler. Yeah, because TCRC is a little bit like Epic, but it's way cooler. And uh, that's where I'm headed now off to. That's uh, TCRC for a two-week trial. And they have lots of classes that I was hoping to take. Yeah. Yeah, because they have a lot of classes in there I was hoping to take. Yeah, I'm taking some classes, you know, just classes for my two-week trial and stuff. And if it all goes well... Maybe I'll just stay at TCRC myself and whatnot. And uh, if you may now know, I got my eBay package uh, right here. Yes, this is my cool eBay package right here. And you're going to love it. So uh, allow me to get it opened. Uh, but to do so, I think I first need to get the tripod. If I can see the, uh, I don't have the tripod up here, don't I? Oh dear. But I got a better idea. Hmm. There we go. This will give me enough time. Hope it does. Hope it doesn't fall. Hmm. Okay, now let's take a look and see what's in there, shall we? Let me take a look. See what we got. How do you even... <sighs> okay, I need the scissors for this. Or... Use my teeth. Oh, here he is. Uh, one second. Get ready and feast your eyes, everyone, on <gasps> my own awareness Scooby-Doo plush. Isn't he cute? My my very own awareness Scooby-Doo plush. And yes, I also love Scooby-Doo. Because <laughs> Scooby-Doo came into my life when I was like a very young boy. <laughs> yeah, I loved Scooby-Doo when I was younger. And it's really cool. I love Scooby-Doo. <laughs> really cool. I love Scooby-Doo. He's so cool. And this plush of him is really cute. As in the Awareness Scooby-Doo plush. That's really cute. Uh-oh. I think his tag is missing, isn't it? Uh, but don't worry. <laughs> I hope I can get him a new one. Or has it fallen into the package? Uh, let me take a look. I think it must have fallen in. Hang on. I don't think I see it, but I can make a new one. I can make a new one. But don't worry, I can fix it. I can make them a new one. But anyways, I love him. He's so cute. And all these puzzle pieces around him, as you can see here, they actually describe um, how the nerves of, of, of an autistic brain actually connect differently in your autistic brain. Yeah, that's how the nerves connect differently in your own autistic brain. That's really cool. And it's really cool. I love this Scooby-Doo plush. He's so cute. I love him. He's so cute. And ever since I was like a young boy and whatnot, 
Um, Scooby-Doo came into my life when I was really, really young and stuff. Yeah. I one time seen a pup named Scooby-Doo uh, when I was like a very young toddler. <laughs> you know, with Ben Grove, um, who actually, um, you know, um, who's actually seen a pup named Scooby-Doo. Yeah, Ben Grove. One of my friends, um, I used to have play dates with him, and one of his play dates with me is when we watched a pup named Scooby Doo. Yeah, cause yeah, cause still is when we watched uh, a pup named Scooby Doo. It's really cute and positive. And it's really cool for for Scooby and the gang's uh, preteen years, growing up solving mysteries together. A lot of mysteries, that is. Really cool mysteries. And it's really cool. And the reason why I got this Scooby-Doo Awareness plush is because, uh, is because this describes my autism and stuff, and I love Scooby-Doo. That's why. Because, first of all, it best, because, uh, first of all, the puzzle pieces describe my disability, yeah, because still, first of all, the puzzle pieces on his body actually first describe my own disability. That's autism. Yeah, because first of all, those puzzle pieces all around him actually describe my disability. That's autism and stuff. And second of all, because I love Scooby-Doo. He's so cool. I love Scooby-Doo. And speaking of Scooby-Doo, um... I, I do have some, I do have some Scooby-Doo VHS tapes that I have in the playroom. Yeah, my sensory tent fort. And uh, for this awareness um, Scooby-Doo plush, I think I have already given him a name that's called Awareness Scooby-Doo. Or should I say Awareness Scoob for short. Yeah, that's what I would name him. Awareness Scoob for short. Even his full name to um, Awareness Scooby-Doo. Really cute Awareness Scooby-Doo. Really cute. And uh, let me just um, cut off his tag real quick. Yeah, let me cut off that tag real quick. Now that he's my, um, my own first Scooby-Doo plush that I would ever get off of eBay. Really cool off of eBay. And... Uh, and uh, I do know a lot about my sister's, um, you know, I do know about my sister's um, fiance, um, who's uh, Josh Norlin. Um, he actually is right now in college and uh, and he's in college in Texas right now. And also he... Um, and also, he uh, he is also there for, I think, one more year or so. Like, for one more year or so. So, yeah, my sister is going to get married to Josh. Yeah, she's going to get married to him. Yeah, Josh Norlin. Yeah, she's going to get married to him soon. And about Josh Norlin is that he also has... Um, a Fandingo account that he shares with me and my family so that way we can watch movies and stuff. And not to mention that, um, and not to mention that, you know, uh, that also, uh, he has a lot of Scooby Doo's, um, on his account that he knows that I'll love and stuff. And on his um, Fandango account, um, which was Voodoo, yeah, cause yeah, cause still, um, yeah, cause still, which was already called Voodoo one time, and then they changed that name from Voodoo uh, to Fandango now, and whatnot, and whatnot, and that's pretty much most of it. Oh, and I see he's found his favorite snack. Oh, he likes Scooby snacks. Oh, and of course, my father's home, and yeah, my father's back home. 
my father's back home. <laughs> but anyways, uh, let me go into the playroom and then and then show you my Scooby-Doo VHS tapes that I have in the playroom basement. Oh, oh and uh, guys, um, this is one of the cats that um, my family has. Yeah, this is the only cat my family is going to keep. And his name is Ting. And we got Ting from Taps because he's a cute cat. But when we got Ting, he was a little skittish. And about Ting is that he's a little skittish and he can be scared so easily mostly because Ting was actually found on the streets like uh, years ago and he was in animal control for two and a half years and and Taps ha had him yeah after animal control yeah after animal control he was then moved to Taps and stuff and that's where he got Ting. And stuff. And of course, my sister, on the other hand, does have, you know, a black cat. That's a female black cat. She's going to keep for herself. And her name is Vanessa. Yeah, Vanessa is my sister's, um, is my sister's, um, female black cat. Yeah, Vanessa. She's really cute like that. And the two cats do get very playful. But for Muppet, on the other hand, um, they sometimes get along with each other, but not very a lot. Oh. Hi, buddy. Oh. Yeah, he's probably sniffing the Scooby Snacks. <laughs> that awareness Scooby-Doo loves. <laughs> oh, he loves those. Very cool. Oh, and also, um, and of course, um, um, these are my three Scooby-Doo VHS tapes right here. I got from my CRT TV, Original Mysteries, really cool Original Mysteries, and also Mystery Mask Mix-Up, really cool and stuff, pretty cool. And also, last but not least, Winter Wonder Dog, really cool Winter Wonder Dog, it's really cool. I love Scooby-Doo. I love Scooby-Doo really cool. I love Scooby-Doo really cool. I love Scooby-Doo. Yeah, I love Scooby-Doo really cool. It's really cool. I love Scooby-Doo. Now to put these back in, in here and to make sure they're safe. Perfect. Yep. Yep. They're good and perfect. They're really good and perfect. And it's really cool. And I uh, hope you all love it. Oh, very cool. Hope you all love it. And uh, that just about ends my unboxing video of my awareness um, Scooby-Doo plush. And, uh, and also my Scooby-Doo tour. And also trip down memory lane as well. And I hope you all love it. And, uh... As always, I'll see you in the next video. And don't forget to leave a comment below on what you think of my awareness Scooby-Doo plush. That's very cool and stuff. And always, keep on Scooby snacking. And I'll see you in the next video, gang. So, bye for now. Yep. Yep, just like I said. So, uh, bye for now, folks.